here was my second meal of the day, night, early morning. It was some lettuce from a salad, and I took some chicken and made like, I don't want to call it chicken salad, but like a dip with the chicken and some carrots and I put some cheese and bacon bits over it. I don't remember what I put in this because that was days ago. But it was just what I ate. That is like my second meal in the middle of that night. I eat very weird, but it works for me. So, hello, hello. Good morning. It is June 16th, 5.54 in the morning, I think. 5.53. Happy Father's Day to all of the fathers out there that are celebrating today. I am not saying happy Father's Day to anybody in my family because I don't talk to nobody in my family other than my mom. By choice, I blocked everybody coming into this year. That's not what this is about. I wanted to actually say hello because I really suck at doing that. But I am adding today with what I recorded the other day. And if the color on me keeps changing, it's the light that I have over there see now it's a different color it's a smart bulb so I have it cycling through the colors but I vlogged the other day but it's not enough for it to be a standalone so I'm going to include today in that because I have been trying to fix my sleeping schedule and get on a more normal sleeping schedule and I just haven't, what I've been doing just hasn't been working for me. Like at this point right now, I'm sleeping in until between like 4 and 6 p.m. And going to bed at like between 7 and 9 a.m., maybe 10 a.m. And that's just not the schedule that I want to be on so I said that when I woke up yesterday that I was going to stay up as long as I could today so that hopefully I can stay up until maybe like I don't want to say a time because I feel like when you say a time that you're going to go to bed you never go to bed at that time and in my case it would be going to bed before that time because I'm starting to get a little tired now because it's basically 6 a.m. but I want to stay up as long as I can and make it to like the p.m. hours so that I can start to change the time that I'm waking up and like if I can stay up until at least like 2 p.m. then I'll wake back up at like probably like 10 p.m. 11 p.m. probably between like 9 p.m. and 11 p.m. and then hopefully it can just get later and later that I'm laying down like instead of 2 maybe 4 maybe six and eight you know and then waking up at midnight and 2 a.m until it gets to like my goal is to get to because i know i'm never going to be a morning person like that's just what that is and i'm fine with that but i want to be like an afternoon person like i want to wake up between 11 a.m and 12 p.m and go to bed no later than 3 a.m 2 a.m., 3 a.m. I just need to cycle, cycle it back around. Today is going to be hell because for sure I'm going to be ready to go to sleep by 8, 9 a.m. And everything after that is going to be hell. I may have to take a nap, but I'm not going to get in my bed because if I get in my bed, I'm going to get comfortable and I'm not going to wake up until I'm going to sleep, sleep. When I get to the point where I just absolutely cannot take it anymore, I'll lay down on my couch where it's not comfortable. So I won't sleep that long. It really will be just a nap, probably like an hour. I'm trying to be smart about it. But this is the only way that I can think of to get myself back on a regular 
sleeping schedule because what I'm doing right now is just not working. It's just not getting later. I'm going to have to just fight through it and stay up as late as I can today. Right now, I am going to make me a smoothie bowl because I am starving. But I am not going to cook because the little bit of food that I have left that I made last night, I want to save that for later to eat before whenever I do go to bed. Like I'm running very low on groceries. Hopefully on Wednesday, I can use up the rest of my food stamps and walk to Publix and get some stuff after I go to the nail salon hopefully Wednesday I'm just trying to make what I have last until then but I'm gonna make a smoothie bowl like I really hate to run my blender this early but I'm hungry and I want to save that food that I have for later and like now I've been thinking about it so now I just have a taste for a smoothie bowl gonna do that in probably like an hour or so I'll put some clothes in the washing machine but I just really don't want to make a lot of noises early because I doubt that my neighbors are awake or the ones under me because I'm on the third floor I'm about to blend I'm gonna try to do it quick so let's get to it this is seven minutes this is gonna take me 45 minutes to edit these seven minutes all right let's get to it and y'all pray that I can get my sleep schedule back on track starting today. It's going to be hell.
this is the food. I fixed way too much, but the rice and the taco meat and cheese. And I wasn't gonna put the guac on top and put the chips here. But after I take it out of the microwave, a lot of the grease seeped. I have the chips here. And the guac, and I did season it because the guac to me just is very bland, very unseasoned. My first meal of the day. And it's after 10 p.m. And I have my cherry coke and my water. So I'm gonna eat. Oh, 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 oh